Hello everyone. We are out of focus and that means WMD has a new product. I would like to announce the WMD Digital VCA, a dual voltage controlled attenuator that utilizes digital circuitry to process the control voltages. This gives you some interesting features such as normal VCA mode, gate update on gate mode, and a zero crossing detector which only allows for control voltage updates to be processed while your signal is at the ground potential. This mode eliminates pops and clicks and all the annoying stuff from using very fast envelopes. So this is a patch with a very fast envelope controlled Here's, I'm controlling the decay speed. And you can hear all those pops and clicks. This is zero crossing detector. This is a patch using a simple maths envelope set to a, the fastest attack time it will go, going directly into the CV control. This is instant mode, and this is using a very low frequency oscillator. Now, if I turn this to zero crossing detector, you heard no audio because it's sub, it's running about eight hertz. The zero crossing detector stops the digital VCA from updating when the audio signal or the any input signal is not at a zero crossing. So you can see how the CV LED responds differently. This is responding quickly. Now it's sort of blinking and changing in more of a sample and hold type of manner. That's because of the low frequency only allows for CV updates at certain points. So turning the audio frequency up, Here are those pops and clicks from instant updates. So now we have a sawtooth wave modulating the sine wave. And if we go gate mode, it's only updating on a positive going edge. since these are very close in frequency. Oops. And zero crossing detector eliminates all pops and excess noise. Here's a patch using the gamma wave source, just simply clocked with a very fast envelope from the Autobot and turning on zero crossing detector. You hear all the pops and clicks go away. This is a patch using the multi-mode envelope to generate a fairly fast envelope, and it's being updated instantly, zero crossing detector, and then I'm going to plug in a random source from the snazzy Chaos Brother. So you can see that the level is only being updated when there's a green flash. When there's a positive going gate signal. So for audio, this isn't particularly interesting, but for modulating a filter, you can basically use digital VCA as a sample and hold. This is a patch with an LFO running through the second channel of the digital VCA doing the wave scanning on the gamma wave source. So right now it's in instant update mode 
and it's ignoring this signal being plugged into the gate update jack. So this is a control voltage, uh, the gate signal coming from the Autobot. So turning this to gate causes the wavetable scanning to just happen on positive going edges or the start of notes. Control voltage for this is an LFO, and the, the input signal is just a positive voltage. This is a patch using the gamma wave source running through the quad anti-aliasing filter. CV from the anti-aliasing filter is being controlled by the digital VCA in gate mode. The gate is coming from the accent input here into the SSF positronic transient gate into the input signal. So that's producing a nice little Vactrol envelope to control the quad anti-aliasing's filter cutoff. Thank you. 